Sup guys, it is the Cornish Gamer and I am back with an another episode of my Civilization 5 Brave New World as Venice playthrough. So anyway, um, one thing I've noticed from last time, since we set up the new trailers, our GMP has gone from 99 to 162, which is amazing. Rome seems to be dominating on the manufactured goods and crop yield sort of side of things. And honestly, as I sort of thought would happen, um, uh, it, it, the era key just dominates, and they had the most land, the land grabbing little bastards. And yeah, um, we were building the leading tower of Pisa, we were increasing our science, or oh, Tom Octo was increasing science, and we actually started intercontinental trade routes, which is great. And we had our caravel somewhere. So, yeah, and we are trying to find every sieve on the map so that we can create the World Congress. There's three left. We haven't discovered the person first. I'm sort of worried at how good he's doing. Genghis Khan is having a pretty shocking game, to be honest. He's not playing too well. So, let's see what happens. When our caravans explore. Yeah, we have two here. But I reckon the next two sieves are on this continent here. Oh, hello. Hello! So basically, Nebuchadnezzar, as intimidated as he looks, he is really scientific. His special ability is that he earns um, great scientists 50% faster than any other Civ. So he is probably going to be looking to win a scientific victory. Oh, and he's top as well, which is surprising considering I'm first in literacy. But oh well, anything can happen. I reckon, honestly, it's going to be me and Mr. Babylon competing to win. Because I reckon at the moment I'm in a good state to win the diplomatic victory. And he is really high in the leaderboards. And I expect, even though I'm ahead of him in the moment, he probably will end up overtaking me. I have 129 signs, which is pretty decent for this sort of era, but it isn't amazing. So, Caravel is carrying on exploring. Only two more people left to find. Got a Brazilian spy. Hola. Should we forgive him, guys? You know, I I'm gonna, f I'm gonna forgive him. But if it happens again, Gobble time from Ram Kamakanga Kang Kang ended when we fronted silk. Um. Okay, so now we have silk to trade. Rowan, would you like some silk? Nah, five iron. I'm not gonna accept that. Babel, are you? Where the new people I've met. Yeah, mate, I get it. Yeah, nothing you can really offer. He's losing quite a bit of gold. What are you, some guy, my best friend? Sup? Um, uh, yeah, you have nothing to offer. I want someone with quite a bit of gold. What are you, Russia? Um, oh, I'm already trading silk with her, I believe. Genghis Khan, sup? I'm with his buddy. Yeah, you have Nah. Does anybody have anything to offer? Let's just quickly go here. Who are Arthur? Who are Arthur? Nah, I'm already trading with him. Um, Greece, hello. Oh yeah, actually, I'm going to be competing with Greece as well to win the diplomatic victory. We've got a lot of strong contenders in this game, I'll say that. Pedro. There's no one who has, like, any, like, ah, uh, damn. Corn, cool, I have silk to trade ways. Anyone want any luxury resources? Um, yeah, go ahead, King's Gone. But yeah, I'm actually surprised by um the fact I actually attempt that I actually sort of yeah. You better regret this. So I always I, I already forgave you. I forgive you. Um. So, oh, finally, finally, a decent offer. Yeah. On, only two more people left. Come on. And I reckon they're somewhere around here. There better not be Arctic blocking off our way to explore. I reckon they're somewhere around here. Cahokia, hello. Caravan, you're going to Venice. Killed a Russian spy. Well, of course, the Russian would be Russians be spying. Um. By any cannon discovered. Let's send my pikeman over. Go take it down. Actually, at the moment, I don't really think we need to, um... Oh, yeah. I don't really think we need to, um... 
build any more units. Like, if we look at the demographics, on soldiers we're second. Which with Venice is pretty damn good. Some guy, we've sort of took him down a notch. I believe he has a city there. There might actually be a Siam city, I'm not sure. Um, yeah, go ahead. Give me gold. Lots of gold. Five more turns and we get the leading tower of Pisa. So, uh, let me just... Oh, hello. Hmm. How about... You give me free iron, but one gold per turn along with it. Yeah, cool. I'd just rather get gold than that. So I have a science now, 130. Yeah. yeah, you better regret it. Yep, I, I, I'll forgive you again. She seems overly happy with the fact she's been spying on me. You should like, oh no, we've been spying on you, we're so bad. But this time they seem a bit lenient. Oh, she seems a bit lenient. No! No, 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 no. Pike, man! See that? Put Raining Cam on the air, stuff you. We may, You may have took our workers, but we took your home. Um. Let's go for acoustics. Yeah, there's no Arctic blocking it off. I believe we are going to be pretty damn close to discovering every sieve. I think we're going to do it soon. Which is a good thing. Wait, where's our other character? Oh, he's there. Bloody hell. Oh, yeah. Okay. More gold for me. Wait, when? when how quick are we earning great merchants? This is another reason I'm going to lean to have Pisa, because we need to get as many like great merchants of Venice as possible, or merchants of Venice, because then we can just spam the um conduct trade mission in um uh, in Kuju did the we can just send all our merchants of Venice over to there and then just earn two thousand gold every single time. Which is good. A few more turns we get another social policy. And things are going well in Venice. We've already got a size 24 city, and that's considerably big. I mean, if you compare it to everyone else's. You have a 13, 10, 11. You and the Iraqi don't even have that big of a city. Ah, oh, come on, I'm just chasing this guy. Caravan. To them. I just realised we actually have more trade route opportunities now. We'll build a few um, trade units in Venice in a sec. About to get leading Tower of Pisa. Okay, Nebuchadnezzar is about to enter the, Ren the Renaissance Renaissance era, not how to pronounce it. Because this is going to be a magic castle, yeah, no one cares. So if we want to attack Tree, uh, we're quite far ahead of him. If he just entered the Renaissance era, then we're quite far ahead of, them, of him. Actually, wait, we still got that Turim there! Oh my god! What are you doing here? The entire pizza. Oh, free for your of our choice. <laughs> oh, look at the gold. This is a list of the most richest people on the game. Just look at us. Yeah, this is why Venice is so good. Um, I went that way. Where are they heading? I think it's the nearest barbarian encampment, so. Probably over there. What have you got? Oh, you got them to fire it. Yeah, one turn. Okay, let's delete the this guy. He's been here for like freaking ages. There you go. Of course, we're gonna go for a match in Venice. Let's send them over to Kuji. Conduct a trade mission. Choose production. We'll go for a cargo ship and send it over to Genoa. Yeah, at the moment, Genoa's been our main source of money, which is great, because that's what I want sort of to be, sort of to be like, well, sort of to be like the coastal sort of trading area for our empire. It's sort of a shame that Venice can't be it, but oh well. Augustus Caesar's declared war on Alexander. Yes, please take him down. Please. It would just make life so much more easier. Well, he's already got Sparta. They must have had a few conflicts in the past. It would be so good to wipe him out of the game, because that means, um... That would just be so much more easier for me to win. I still have every luxury resource. Allows the purchase of great merchants of faith. Oh my god. Okay. Boom. Achievement unlocked. Money doesn't grow on trees. Indeed it doesn't. 
Chase Nas is a lot more happy as well. But my aim at the, in this episode is to get our gold up to plus 100 per turn. Which I reckon we can do. Also, we might be able to discover every sieve. Might. But I sort of doubt it. Might, might discover another one. But I'm not sure. Oh, he's still running away. Caravan, you're going to Valletta. I still have things on guys to attack me, so I'm still keeping my units here. But I still just want to keep some guy at bay for a bit. I have more important things to worry about. Or to earn money about. <laughs> yeah, there's one little mansion of Venice, Mr. Gaspar Balbi. Zoo. Yeah, good see we're getting our happiness back on track after we took over two Song Guy cities. Another thing about Venice is it's a lot more easier to actually handle your happiness as well. Oh, there they are. And there's a missionary there as well. Wait, that might be my old missionary. Oh, yeah, I was going to move him to Genoa. So, another cargo ship said it's to Genoa. Yeah, do you know it's got a lot of trade routes going out of it now? It's got one, two, three, four, and it will soon have more. Just really hope there's not barbarians out of sea, in deep sea anyway. See how long that freaking trade route is? I wish you go gained more gold along the trade route was, because that one would have been like loads. Whoa, 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 I just noticed something. Whoa. Hex grid, why are you? Okay, let's take down them, see if we can get a missionary. Might actually be our own, so it'd be good to get it back. Stuff our worker. Cargo ship, you can go to... When the most? You can go to Sparta. Karen, you can go to Gao. Next turn. What's this Caraval doing? He needs to be going that way. Might actually take over this caravel, put it off auto explore, and just explore around the island, try and find everyone. Oh, oh, um, yeah, go ahead. I just sort of want to get the World Congress before Alexander does. Yeah, go ahead. Woo! Greece has returned, has regained Sparta. Called a song guy spy. I thought I told you not to spy on me. I swear I did. <laughs> it was our um thing as well. Good to you know. Wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? Good to you know. It was our missionary as well. That's cool. What can I build? Grand temple. Opera house. Bank. So actually put a constable. It will stop them from stealing from us. Well, as, as easy anyway. Well, yeah. Um, you send it back to Sparta. So this is Sparta. I really, really, I forgave him. I forgave him before. I demand you cease spying. So I've had, I've had enough of you, mate. What's he saying? I'm sorry, I can't forgive you, mate. Like I said, that face is so creepy at the end. Look, ready, ready. <coughs> so creepy. Um, yeah, Genghis Khan. He seems like a good, trustworthy guy. What is this caravel doing? That way. If he moves again, then I'm going to go take him over. Oh, actually, he's almost gone all the, way, all the way around the world. Actually, yeah, go ahead. Actually, no, no. I, I wanted to explore there. Please. Oh, he's trying to prove that the Earth's round. Nah, mate. Nah, you're alright. Oh, great. I think I'm fortified for a bit. A missionary? You can actually go to the capital. Cargo ship. 
you can go to Formus. Yes, hundred and seven. Look at look at Genoa, just like earning them monies. Um what was I gonna do again? Oh, there you go. Stop automation. I don't care if you want to prove the earth is round, you will not be the person to do it. <laughs> really, Genghis Khan? Really? Okay, how about 100 gold on my part? Cool. 100 gold isn't really much to me. It is to the peasants. But yeah, from what I can see, it just seems like a continent here, and then another continent there, and there's not, nothing really else, to be honest, just a bit here. But we sort of know what the map looks like now. We just sort of need to... It's just, oh, we're actually doing pretty well when it comes to that as well. Kill the Siamese spy. It would actually be, it would just be really good to get it before we end, we exit out the Renaissance era. Much of Venice. Conduct trade mission. Look at our money go up. Almost up to 10,000 now. Spread religion. Adopt the religion. Catholicism. Hmm. I forgive him before. I've, I'll forgive you. You have a funny voice, so. I'll forgive you! He always asks again. Sort of weird how it does that. Never could Nezu complete the Forbidden Palace, do we? Yeah. He's a bit pissed off. Oh, I'll forgive you because I like you. <laughs> uh, some guy trying to expand. That's a shame. What's with the constabulary? Trade route plundered. No! No! Oh, me hurt just a faith. Cool. What can we buy? Another missionary. Hmm. Why not? Trade production. Go for caravans. We can get our trade route there going again. Let's spread it more. Spread! Catholicism, you must adopt. <laughs> I reckon that's going to um, sort of take over there soon. Actually, we're in a golden age as well. It's pretty why well we're earning so much money, actually. I just realised we actually probably need more um, workers. We have a severe lack of work. We only have one. And he's there. Actually, we have two. But we need more. With our empire expanding, we need more. Oh, hi. oh hello. Boom. Yeah, mate, I don't think that's strong enough. Where should we send this missionary if I'm freaking dying? I reckon some guy wants to adopt that. <laughs> nah. I'm not gonna piss off some guy more than he already is. Uh, I sent you to dead. Hopefully, you don't get destroyed this time. Um, you could head back home. I'm about to get musketmen in three turns, actually. That's finally discovered guns. Okay, where's our, how's our carol doing? Yeah. Yeah, come on, explore. See shallow water there, that could be another sieve. You never know. We could actually send a few, like, units over on this, onto this continent to actually explore. But at the moment, there seems to be a massive sort of war going on between them two. A train was destroyed by a marauding barbarian. No. Would it be a shame if they were to die? Okay, cool. Um, caravan. Wait, ca ca these guys actually create caravan. No. Okay, caravan. You go to Tomac Two. Wait, is it Tomac Two? Yeah, Tomac Two. Okay. Cheese production. Let's build a build a bank. Get our get even more money. Yep, and it turns out it is. But you, Mark, wanted to prove that the earth is round. The earth is not round, this is flat. What are you on about? Well at least our sieve thinks so anyway. I mean it's sixteen twenty five, you think they would be a little bit more smarter. 
Actually, maybe not. Actually, I don't know. Did they know the earth was round in 1625? Oh, I don't know. Yeah, Babylon seems to have this sort of kitted out empire here. Compass. Hmm. Don't like people stealing text from me. Makes me angry. Dude, how much money is it? Oh, 70. 70. And with that bank, it'll be even more. Surprised Genghis Khan and Brazil haven't gone to war, actually. Sort of surprising. Wait, so if that's our carol there, where's our other one? Where on earth is our other caravel? Oh, he's there. Oh, he's going around the other way. Okay. Cool. What I just... I just discovered something. Oh, oh yeah, gunpowder. Cool. Um, what should we go for next? Economics. Oh, die and prove gold yield. Yes. We're finally moving on to, you know, actual decent techs. Like... Things that shoot. Ooh. Oh, it's good to see Genoa is actually building the bank as well. Tom Buck 2 and thing are still focusing on its rubbish stuff that I've already got. Okay. So. Could have Greek spies with Greece. Never liked them in the first place. Go to Onondaga. Um, can I actually go for the Grand Temple. Yeah, because I, I know in the industrial area you can buy um, you could buy um. Oh, he actually yeah, made it. Spread. Yes. He's converting. Or oh, the city says converting. Not he. I'm not sexist. It could be a girl. Oh, I really want to discover those other two sieves. Come on, where are you? Yeah, you should be ashamed. I'll forgive you, mate. Oh, I forgave him before as well. Damn it. He's with Greece. Never liked them. Taking out the mighty Rome. Rome shall live on. Okay, what are you doing? He's going to Sidon now. Anyone here? No? Whoa, 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 whoa. First of all, what what unit upgrades to the um musket man, or is it like a completely new unit? I think it's a completely un new unit, but where's that going to? That's probably going to another sieve, which means there may be another new sieve, or are you simply trading with someone on this side, like Bucharest or Yerevan. Hopefully not. Hopefully it's a completely new sieve, but it doesn't look like he is. So if we sort of follow this cargo ship, then maybe we could find a new civilization. Because we've got ten, including me, that is. We just need uh, those last two. And I reckon they're on this continent. On this side. Because you found the right side. But we need to find out the left side. Oh crap, you need orders. Um, convert. Join Catholicism, become Catholic. Yes, you're Catholic. You're not yet, but we've got pressure, religious pressure, which means, yeah. Wales. Yeah, you can have Wales for wine. That'll get, increase my happiness and your happiness, so. Hmm, nah, mate, I'm alright. He seems okay to me. Uh, yeah, as the game goes on, it slowly sort of the turns sort of become slower, and later on in the game, the turns aren't they aren't ridiculously slow, but it can get a bit annoying. 
I have met Florence, another ally of freaking Greece. Shit, it doesn't matter at the moment. Oh, it's going to Riga, damn it. You have to go. Oh, no. There better be two new sieves around here. If not, I'm not going to be too happy, but... Just look, look at the massive gap. Oh, they've already got, actually got musketmen. I just saw a musketman there. Come on. You got a caribou exploring there. Actually, let's just, let's just check out our advice. We haven't actually spoke to him in a while. Not just grief him. Oh, the Yerkes actually stronger than us. So. Uh, yeah, we're, we're pretty much stronger than everyone. Uh, economic, yes. Oh, economic's probably the most important. Yeah. We well, can't found cities. There's these workers. Doing yeah, I agree. Do you know these workers? Yeah. Everyone needs workers. So, let's go buy a worker in a sec. Our CBA to just make it. Venice. Purchase. Worker. Might buy two, actually. We get Grand Temple in one turn. Yeah, swimming boards, why not? Actually, yeah, we need it because they're there. But I reckon though, oh, I've actually had it on a save where sieves on their own little separate little continents were isolated from everyone else. That could be the case. I sort of need to end the episode here. Well, I don't need to, but I sort of just want to carry on. Just carry on for a bit longer. Um. Let's go for. Let's go for a zoo to increase happiness. Why not? Worker, but improvements. Let's purchase another worker. And set him to build improvements. Russian, as no idea. Come on, where's the other sieves? Come on, so we got that guy there. And it looks like he's going to be blocked off by Arctic, which sort of sucks. So now it's just this guy here. Or it could be landlocked. If they're landlocked, then that makes it super annoying. Yeah, I think it's he's blocked off there. That's why he's going away. Come on! <laughs> Worker, you build improvements. I think that's enough workers. Where was you where were you heading? You were uh, you a new one? I think you're a new one. He usually says where it was trading. What would give me the most sort of gold? And turn the bar oh a seed on. They actually give me the most. Look at that, 144 gold. It's ridiculous. Enemy denunciation of you has expired. Oh, cool. That means nobody really is affected by some guys denouncing of me. Which is really good. Okay, what's going on here? We need to find a new sieve. I'm sort of getting tired now. My caravan is heading around the continent. Ugh, this is so frustrating. Okay, caravan, what are you doing? Oh, hello, Hanoi. It's a shame you're not on a sieve. No, I'm just gonna rush through this. I sort of just wanna get. We'll f find another sieve. Come on. Where's the new sieve? I'm not giving you that much. Stuff off. Is he, is he, does he think I'm a mug? No. I'm not giving you that much. Oh, God. Caesar, mate. Calm down. He's took back and Sparta. I think he's going to head in for Athens now. I don't think we'll be able to take down Athens. I reckon they'll make peace soon. Actually. Predictions of Aaron. Or Conch Gamer, whatever you want to call me. Brazil store education. Nah, that's not, that's not cool. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Finally! Someone else! Someone else! I'm not going to give away who it is. I know who it is, but, you know, I'll just leave it for you guys to see. Finally! <laughs> so long! That means there's one more player, and if he's landlocked someone somewhere in there, I am going to be pissed. 
Okay, finally, we've actually found someone else. Took long enough. One person left. Play another. Oh, no, he's not. Oh, hello. <laughs> Look at his shorts. I know this guy's like a great leader, but I'm sorry. Look at those shoes. Wait, just say, just say, just say. Except never see. Look at his shoes and look at his <laughs> look at his shorts. Oh, what a legend! I think I've had my new best friend. Caravan. You can go to. I can actually go here because you. Come on, I just want to get as quickly as possible. I really need to find this last person. Well, I really want to anyway. Go for an opera house. Caravan. Like this. You. Carry on going. Okay, you know what, guys? I'm going to end the episode here. So, we only have one person left to find. I have no clue who he is. Or she. Or she. Or she. But, yeah, it's sort of annoying we couldn't actually find everyone in this episode. We're almost halfway through turns of the game. That doesn't mean it'll end in episode 12. It just means we're halfway through the amount of turns. Because the turns get a lot longer after a while, as you guys have probably noticed, actually. Okay, we've got a lot more gold now. Anyway, yeah, this has been the Lazy Gamers 66. Be sure to like... Oh, not Lazy Gamers! Sorry, again. The Cornish Gamer. Um, be sure to like, subscribe, share with your friends, add to your favourites, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.